So we know closing thoughts now. Talk to Kenyans. We have 23 days and 23 nights. If we are going to an election, what do you tell Kenyans right now? Uh, I have always seen the former prime minister when he's in political rallies. He says, Fulani Nampira, Fulani Nampira, Fulani Nampira. The truth is, election is just like a football match. We are not electing a non Kenyan. We are electing one of our brothers. I will not say sister because there's no lady running. We are going either to elect President Uhuru Kenyatta to continue or the former Prime Minister. These people are simply Kenyans and they are coming in as the CEOs. They are not coming in carrying their, the communities where they come from or their friends. They are the CEOs. Every person should only put forward his ideology and every Kenyan should only listen to what they are saying, wake up in the morning, go and vote. I said before the last election, mm. Kenyans go and vote so that we get 50 plus 1 mara moja. We don't want, we, can, we, we policemen, we get strained mm. during elections mm. because you are competing negatively, you are doing bad things. We are asking Kenyans, if for example you want to, to but history stops us from asking you to go and have a peaceful demonstration because we know kenyans will never be peaceful they will always carry arms they'll always want chaos and you know politicians especially when people are demonstrating when a person dies you see them crying crocodile shedding crocodile tears oh so and so has died but you see it gives them political mileage when people can just have peaceful demonstrations it will not have the impact that the politicians want. And that is why they put us in a very awkward position. I would want to request every Kenyan, be patient, go about your business. Whoever becomes president is the president of the Republic of Kenya. We are not bringing a Rwandis, a Ugandan, a Tanzanian. And this issue of Ukabila that we say here in Nairobi, people say, oh, I'm Kikuyu, I'm Luo. When we go back to the village, when you, I go back to my county, for example, the CIA county today, you'll hear people saying, oh, you are from Alego, oh, you are from Mugenya, oh, we cannot have a governor from Rareda, oh, we cannot do this. Now, when I go back to Ugenya, again, we start clan issues. Oh, you are from Boro clan, oh, you are from this clan, oh, you are from Mukwala, oh, you are from where? When now we are even looking for assistant chief, we go even lower. Mm. So this issue we are seeing at the national level is a disease of Kenyans, which must stop. Yeah. The same way you are complaining at national level about tribalism, the same way you are complaining at county level, the same way. So you should know it is not a, it is not a problem at the top. It is a problem that is starting from the ground. Kenyans should go. Be patient, go about your business. If you're a teacher, go and teach. If you're a doctor, go to go, go, go to hospital. If you're a policeman, go and work. We need this country to do business. We need to create wealth. Jeff, we don't have many years to live. Even if we live up to 100, it is not many years to live. And even when you pass 80, 90 years, you don't enjoy anything. Mm -hmm. So this time when we have energy, let us do business. Let us create wealth for this country. Let us be rich. Let us enjoy, let us be in good health, not negative politics day in and out. As a prefect of the republic, because I'm a policeman, mm -hmm. I'm the prefect, I want to tell Kenyans, please give us easy time. Allow us to protect you from thieves and robbers and al-Shabaab. We should not start fighting with our own brothers that you are rioting, that you are stealing people's properties. Mm. It's not good. We wait for the time to come for elections. Go and elect your president. When they finish, yeah. let it be like a football match. Greet your brother. Tell him congratulations. Let's work together. And the country moves on. Just As like policemen, yes. the bad name we have it has been created by the public because you want to kill your brother and you don't want us to say at our word. You want to steal from your brother? You don't want us to utter what? I want to tell you. Sisi tulichukua kazimbaya na jinambaya. Ukipiga ndugu yako, we will deal with you. Ukiibia ndugu yako, we will deal with you. Siku ya tutakufa, mungu atamua. Mungu atasema wino wewe ulichagua kazimbaya. Na tulijua ulikuwa na saidia maisha wana inchi, weenda binguni. Na tutaenda. Na wewe utaenda kwa hell. So we are saying that as a country, let us move together. Let us help ourselves. Yes. Let us elect our leaders. After all, none of them will share with you his salary. No.
at all. Kama wewe ni mama mboga, mm. you will continue na mama mboga. Correct. Kama wewe ni askari kama wino, mm. you will continue. Kama ni Jeff, I've always seen you. I'm told you come from the big family. And what am I doing here at 4 a.m.? Because you must work. There's nothing for free. Thank you. Are you waiting me? Thank you. I must work. Yes. There's nothing for free. Thank That's you. True. So it is not an issue of who becomes the president of the Republic no, of Kenya. It doesn't. Okay. I'm a policeman, but the prefect. So we must tell Kenyans. Kabisa. Charles. Be positive. Yes. Let people do their business. Let people continue with their normal lives. Mm. As policemen, where we are wrong, we are a large family. We must always have one or two officers who may not do the right thing. We know what to do with them, but support us. Mm. Give us support where it's necessary. If we make a mistake, we allow criticism, but go to the background of the problem. All right. Charles, we know the Assistant wow. Inspector General of Police, Utumishi Kwawote. Mm -hmm. We salute you, sir. Thank you so much. And uh, all your people who work with you, we tell them, and Eleni Nakazi, work has to be done. Whether to pende or to si pende. That's the bottom line. Asante San and Dugu, good luck and all the best. The Hot Breakfast with Jeff and Jelano.